Tensions in Jerusalem erupting at one of the holiest times of the year for Jews, Muslims, and Christians. Palestinians and Israelis clashing at the historic Al-Aqsa Mosque. More than 150 Palestinians hurt Israeli forces storming the mosque. Tonight, hundreds of people under arrest. Here's ABC's Lama Hassan with the latest. Tonight, Jerusalem on a knife edge after Israeli security forces storm the Al-Aqsa Mosque, one of Islam's holiest sites, with Muslim worshippers gathered for Friday prayers. Firing tear gas and stun grenades inside the mosque. More than 150 Palestinians were injured and at least four Israeli soldiers were wounded. Israeli officials insist they waited until after prayers and release this video, which they say shows Palestinians throwing stones and fireworks below at the Western Wall. The site sacred to both Muslims and Jews, where the Haram al-Sharif and the Temple Mount are located. Clashes here ignited an 11-day war with militants in the Gaza Strip last year. Tensions already extremely high after several recent attacks inside Israel including a gunman opening fire at a bar in the middle of a bustling street in Tel Aviv, killing three Israelis. And tonight the holy city is calm, but some fear it is a fragile calm. With the Jewish festival of Passover taking place during the Islamic holy month of Ramadan, as well as the Easter celebrations this weekend, the Israeli prime minister saying they are preparing for any scenario. Cecilia. Lama Hassan, thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.